Okay, now, uh, one of the things that I wanted to show you today is an application called, well, it's just called Chase. This is an app on the iPhone, and uh, it's just right there. It's Chase, okay? This, this is Chase. It says Chase. So I have Bank with Chase. So I open this application up, and I am able to log on to my Chase account. And I log on. I'll spare you showing my password to you. So I enter in my password, and my password is, okay... And I log on. You're being securely logged on. Thanks for your patient. Patience. I can check. I can check all my balances. Um, see what's been deposited. See how much money I have in the account, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And then there's a really cool feature that call this called deposits. So I click on deposits, and it says like this. It says um, deposit to. And then it shows uh, the account, amount, and then you scan the front and the back of the check. Now that's pretty crazy. So anyway, this is how, I don't go to the bank anymore to deposit my checks. I just do it right here. So I, I do have a check, okay? And you're supposed to put it on a black background. I found this little notebook works well. And so what I'm going to do is the amount of the check, this is from a client of mine. It's a small one. Uh, one hundred sixty-two dollars and thirty-eight cents. Okay, one sixty-two dot thirty-eight. Okay, I type that in, and then I let me see. I need to pick the account that I need to deposit in, and I'm going to put this in the business classic uh, account, and then I just need to scan the front and the back. All right. So I'm going to tilt this camera down a little bit. And I'm pretty sure you do need to uh, sign it, so I'm gonna just gonna sign the back of the check here. So I sign the back of the check, and then I put uh, the check down. Uh, I click on a button that says "Check Front to Take Picture," and I just need to uh, keep it between the blue lines here and press the uh, "Take Photo" button. And it takes a picture, and then I take a picture of the back of the check. And just tells you to hold it steady. And then, you know, it asked me to uh, review the photo of the check, uh, which I never do. I just tell it to use it. It's either going to work or it's not, you know. Um, so there we go. Then it shows me a, a kind of a little recap. It shows me what account I'm going to deposit into, the amount of the check, and then a picture of the front and the back. And then I click on Next. And it says Loading, Loading. That's always fun, but you know, it takes a little bit of time. So, uh, da da da. And then um, I just hit submit. I hit submit. And uh, boom. Then it asked me, you know, if I want to deposit another check, and I'm done. And uh, this will show up in, in my account as a deposit, probably within like 24 hours. And then it also has, of course, the picture of the check. So in other words, you know, when you go to the bank right now, they, um, they run your check through a little thing. We well, you know what that little thing is doing? It's a little scanner. So they're just basically taking a picture of your check and then entering the amount into the computer. Well, why can't we do this ourselves? Well, we can. I can take a picture of it of the front, I can take a picture of the back, I can enter the amount, I can tell it what account it goes to, and I can hit submit. So you don't have to go to the bank anymore.
Chase has got it online. So anyway, do you understand why this is a revolution? If you ignore this, you're ignoring the biggest thing that has happened in technology since the internet. This is, this is like, this is the new revolution of the internet. Internet revolution one was just the internet itself and the, and the desktop on your computer. Revolution number two, this baby is going to do everything. And this is the internet gone mobile. So don't ignore this. Trust me, I've been doing this for 12, 13 years. I know what's, uh, what's revolutionary.